Hello everybody and welcome back to Spiritfarer. So, today we are going to help out Jackie some more. We finished up all of Buck's bounty quests last time, so Jackie's the only one we really need to worry about. And they said that they wanted a Zen Garden, so we're going to see what we need to make that real quick, because I'm not really sure. I don't know, but a Zen Garden does sound cool. I would always, I've always wanted one. I don't know where to get them. <laughs> I could probably get one off of Amazon, honestly. Let's see. Oh, wrong one. Uh, let's see. Ah, silk fabric. That's all we need? I can do that. Easy. I have a stockpile of silk. And every other fabric. Is that enough? Hang on. We'll make some of this, too. Oh, jeez. I forgot how fast this one is. That makes it quick. Zoom. 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 Okay, now we do this one. We just go through all this, and we should get it done. Oh, wrong one. Okay, there we go. Oh, Jesus. This is fast, too. But it can be faster. forget. Okay. Improve. Then we... Zen Garden. Oh, there's a bonsai tree in there now. I love bonsai. Oh. Okay. No, I can give you food. You don't have to cry. It's okay. No! Never mind then. <laughs> Whatever was working on it. Could just be a little patient. Neat. Oh, a stone garden. I'm kind of surprised, actually. I didn't think you'd go through with it. It's kind of silly, isn't it? Anyway, let's see what we're working with here. The sand is nice. It's got a good color. And it's very fine, but it still has some texture to it. And the stones, they're very... pleasant? Is that a question? They've got a nice weight. Very stone-like. Even the little wooden rake is all pretty. It's all very soothing. But... My dad had a little sand garden in his office. Just like that, but much smaller. I always wanted to play with it, but he didn't let me. I guess that's the real reason I've asked you for one. Just to get back at him. But you know, he deserved it. That man, hell, he was... Uh... He was... He was okay. Shit. I'm doing it again. I'm lying for no goddamn reason. Mom and Pops were okay. They had their issues, sure, but I'm not messed up because of them. No, that's on me. I don't know why I keep telling these tall tales. Like the one about my grandpa. Truth is, I barely knew him. I saw him once a year, and when I was old enough, he tried to teach me about bees. But I was just a dumb teenager. I didn't care. And then he died. So now I'm a dumb adult who knows jack shit about bees. Guess I want to believe that my childhood messed me up. Otherwise, I'd have to own up to my own shitty behavior. Yeah, maybe that's who I am. Shitty and broken. Heh, <laughs> that'd be fitting. Aww. Oh, uh, yeah. Thanks for the garden, Stella. I'll, uh, see ya. Aww. Well, the important thing is admitting these things. We're seeing some improvement. It may not be because of the Zen Garden, but he is improving. He's... Coming out and he's being honest about everything. Which I'm very impressed with. Considering the way he acted before. So, in a way, and it, it's a very impressive. I know that he's really putting himself down a lot right now, but I can see it. I can see the, the little adjustments that are coming. He's doing his best. It takes a lot to own up to your behavior, but that's the first step. Acknowledging that your behavior is bad is sign of growth. You want food now? Oh, now you're giving me food. 
Dude! Take this lobster roll. There we go. He didn't fly away this time. I just had to corner him. There we go. I completely forgot. We we did all of that last time to build the beehive and then I didn't even do it cuz I completely forgot. And that's just how my brain works. It's smooth and always distracted. ADHD, baby. Okay, uh, do you want 22 old shoes? One second, Jackie. I have to sell the many old shoes I have in my pocket. What's up? I'm here. I got it now. Ooh, another thing? Stella, I have something else to ask you. And I think this might be the one thing I'm missing. You know how I never went to school? Well, I, I mean, I did, but I dropped out of high school. So I figured maybe the problem is that I'm not smart enough. I got all this energy, but I don't know what to do with it because I was never taught. That's an easy problem to solve. I just need to get smarter. And the best way to do that is with books. Mm -hmm. I didn't care for them when I was a teenager. Didn't have the patience. But now that I'm a serious adult, I'm sure I can make it up super easy. Could you get some for me? Self-help books. Okay. Um, I don't... Letting it go for dummies? <laughs> oh my goodness. That is a beautiful title of a book. Uh, up here. Oh, no, wait. I wanted to get away from those noises. I love you, turnip, garlic, whatever you are, man, but you make a lot of noises. I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> bees! 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 Give me the honey, baby boy. Yes! Exactly, Mr. Bean. These bees will have coffee, so that we get some coffee honey. That's gotta exist somewhere. There's this place, it's like a tourist spot, kinda? It's not really a tourist spot, but it's this cool market, and it's giant, and it has like a bunch of different foods from different farms and stuff, and like old novelty items. It's near my hometown, it's a, it's a big place. It, we really like going to it, or at least we did before, you know, everything. Um, but they have like different types of honey from different types of bees based on where they were getting their pollen from. I don't know if that's actually how it works, but I thought it was pretty cool. Alright, what do we need for these books? Rose gold sheet. Okay. I can make those. I think I have enough of this stuff. I don't... Ooh, yes, just enough. Patience is a virtue. And I'm not virtuous, hurry up! Alright, let's see. Oh, wrong thing. There we go. Boom! The books are done. Good morning! Can I feed you or are you gonna run away? Are you hungry at all? No, you're not, but can I have a hug? Oh, Hugs are always the best. I was in dire need of a spirit heal. I was too. I had a final exam yesterday, and it was not fun. I'm confident that I... Past, but also just very tired. Neat! Whoa, books! Yeah, sure takes me back. Maybe I'd have turned out different if I stayed in school. When I dropped out, my parents kicked me out of the house. They... shit. 
No, they didn't kick me out. Not right away, anyway. I spent the next couple of years freeloading. I don't even remember what I did with all my time. Mm. Nothing, probably. They were pretty nice about it. But after a while, we started arguing, like, a lot, and over nothing. Mm -hmm. And then I moved out. I was just too proud, and we pretty much stopped talking. So I guess they didn't kick me out at all. Mm. You know the rest of the story. I needed a job, and the hospital was understaffed. So understaffed that they just hired anybody. What a shit decision that was. Mm. Eh, better get to these books. Thanks, Stella. Interesting. It's interesting to hear more of Jackie's perspective on things. I, I ragged on them a lot when I was younger. Younger? No, I ragged, on one, I ragged on them a lot in earlier episodes. But it's always interesting to see, like, when they start to open up. Because they certainly weren't open with us before, and they were lying a lot, and they were being mean to people. And now they're finally kind of like being honest with themselves. It's good to see, I'm glad. Speaking of, want some honey? Oh, harvested some honey, take it. Oh, thank you. Oh, that was very sweet, thank you. Would you like some corn bread? Oh, that smells nice. You know, I've been trying to eat better recently. Stay away from junk food. So I probably shouldn't, but strict diets never work, you know? The trick is to indulge once in a while. And I've been good, real good. So I'll have this fried food. Thanks a lot, Stella. I've actually never had cornbread. Is cornbread fried? Or am I just an idiot? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna end it here for today. Uh, we didn't do very much, but I still think we made some progress, especially with Jackie. It's cool to hear more about them, so I think this will be a nice episode to just learn more about Jackie and about how they ended up on our boat and how we got here. So maybe we'll learn more about that next time. But until then, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please consider subscribing. Remember to take care of yourselves and have a good day.